Hi, this is a descriptive statistics question. Our idea is to find out the arithmetic mean of medians. The question is to maximize the medians. This is what the question reads as. Positive integers from 1 to 45 inclusive are placed in 5 groups of 9 each. What is the highest possible average of the medians of these five groups. These are the five answer options. Let's get cracking with this question. The objective is to maximize the medians in each group. We have five groups. If we maximize the medians in each group, then we will eventually maximize the average of the medians of all these groups. Let's look at what we need to achieve, right? Let's pick one set and that set which contains the highest possible median. Let's call this set as set 1. This set will have 9 numbers and when these numbers are arranged in ascending order, the fifth number is going to be the median. So if you need to maximize this median, then we need to make sure that the 5th, 6th, 7th, 8th and ninth number of this set when they are arranged in ascending order take the highest possible values that they can take. The ninth number obviously is 45. So if we count down from 45, the 8th number will be 44 and so on and the 5th number of this set is going to be 41. So the median for the set that comprises the largest median is going to be 41. Let's look at the composition of this group which is called set 1. This group has A, B, C, D and then 41 to 45 and obviously the median for this group is 41. So we have picked one out of these five sets, we have assigned the last five numbers of this set 1. This is not the end of it. We need to do one more important step before we can repeat this exercise. Right. Uh, we desired to maximize the medians. And as the first step, we said we will identify any one group that will have the highest possible median. And we took the step of picking up the highest possible 5 values and giving it to that group so that the highest possible median in any of these 5 groups is going to be 41. Right? Corollary to this is if we need to maximize the medians in each group, we should not use any more high values on the first 4 numbers A, B, C, D because these do not influence the decision or the process of maximizing the median of any group. So let's not use any high values on ABCD. Let's fit some values for ABCD and this is how the first group is likely to look. 41 to 45 will be the last five terms. The first four, let's give it the smallest possible four values which is 1, 2, 3 and 4. The median of this group is going to be 41. Let's look at the composition of the next group of 9 numbers. Let's pick the next 5 highest numbers, 36 to 40 and assign them as the last 5 numbers of the second group. And for the first 4 numbers, let's pick as small values as are available. Let's say 5, 6, 7 and 8. Repeating the process, the next 5 highest numbers available or 31 to 35. These become the last 5 numbers of the third group of numbers and the first 4 numbers could be 9, 10, 11, 12. So the median for the third set will be 31. Quickly running through the exercise, the fourth group will appear as follows. 26 to 30 as the last 5 numbers of this group. 13 to 16, the first four numbers of this group. 
the median is 26. In the last group of 5 numbers, the last 5 numbers of this group will be from 21 to 25 and the first 4 numbers 17 to 20. The median for this group is 21. Now let us put all of these things together. We have maximized the median in each group and the collation of the medians are 21, 26, 31, 36 and 41. Right? These are the 5 medians that we have. The last step is to find out the average of these 5 medians. The average of these 5 numbers is going to be the average of the highest medians possible to each of these groups or conversely what we intended to find out was finding out the highest possible average of the medians which is the average of these five numbers. The highest possible average is 31. Right? You could download an ebook on descriptive statistics and understand these concepts behind average, median, mode and deviation.